For me, at least, I believe that people gravitate to, to dope stuff and, you know, there, there wasn't a guideline for all, all of this. There wasn't uh, some template that, you know, people needed to fall in line for. So, you know, I, I think, you know, it's just kind of a testament to what we do and like what we love because we've always been authentic, you know, and, you know, we never played to anyone else's fiddle. Yeah. Um, Francis and I, we've always been in talks before about just collaborating on something after the art gallery. But we never knew what we were going to collaborate on until Francis had brought up Oddly Awesome, which was a passion project of his. You know, I guess my trajectory in life was supposed to be in the medical field and the to be an x-ray tech then, you know, to live up to like my family's like, you know, expectations at that time. And, you know, and I learned that it wasn't for me. So, you know, I was able to carve my path and kind of lean towards a certain way that allowed me to be creative and to live life and like love like what I do through this love of art. Well, we really connected when uh, back in 2012, um, our homie Kev, he was actually opening up an art gallery. Kev had brought me on to design the logo, some of the website stuff, the branding. Francis was a part of the team too, so that's where we really collaborated with, with each other for the first time. I was living with a lot of these stories and these ideas that were living dormant on a hard drive or in my memories or, you know, through these like designer toys or these art books. But like, I just wanted a way to exert that and, you know, tell the story of like what I've gone through, what Mike's gone through and like what we think is dope. And like, you know, sharing the stories of those who we think are talented that, you know, share the same ideals and the same, the same passion that we do, the same vigor and the same love of art that we do. We're lucky in the Bay Area to have had um, a store that really aligned with our vision. Uh, even growing up too, like in high school, we would cut school just to go to the Fillmore, just to visit the store upper playground. Uh, I just remember going out to the city with my friends. We'd all go out to Haight Street. That store alone taught me a lot of the greats like Sam Flores, Jeremy Fish, Usugro, David Cho, Alex Pardee, like all these guys, you know, who have been a staple in the Bay Area or in that level of the art scene that we love and know, you know, it taught me that and it helped me, uh, you know, kind of sculpt my taste in this, in this art scene. Another thing too that really inspired me was the documentary Beautiful Losers that also kind of solidified why I love art. It's because it was like uh, these, these band of misfits that had um, a common passion and they just like lived it. They, they lived through the art and like they made their own world for it. They said, fuck society, like, you know, this is just what I want to do. So you had artists in the film, Ed Templeton, Deanna Templeton, Barry McGee, Margaret Kilgallen, Harmony Kareen, like all these guys, you know, came together uh, for a common purpose and, you know, with the same love of art. And that was inspiring. Personal goal of mine was always just to create cool stuff um, and to have an outlet where I can create stuff and then people can, you know, wear it, vibe with it. Currently, we have collaborations with actually a coffee shop in San Francisco called Andy Town. They enlisted uh, Mike of Oddly Awesome to create a string of merchandise that's going to encapsulate uh, their their fall winter uh, line of their stores, and uh, it, it's it's crazy to think that you know oddly awesome is growing this much because it was just an idea uh, of of someone in their bedroom in the East Bay in Union City, California. Now it's growing exponentially. I, I wish that you know oddly awesome could be a platform where you know a lot of people outside of Union City or California can see my work as well. Yeah, so I'm Francis. I'm Mike Nguyen. And, you know, if you love what we do, please, I hope you continue to back us and like continue to follow us. Um, we really collaborate with like the, some of the best artists in the Bay Area. And I hope that, you know, you love what they do and you love the, uh, you love what we put out. You can catch us at oddlyawesome.com. Our Instagram is oddly.awesome. And we just want to put out dope stuff. So if you, if you love what we do, I hope you continue to follow us. And thank you. Um, yeah.